Python in 120 seconds. <coughs> oh, that's two seconds already. A Python script is a set of tasks in a file that a computer executes when we press run. Developers are lazy, so Python is good to automate manual work. An IDE is where you write and run code. I'm using Spider. How you organize your code is important. The commands are executed top to bottom. Hashtags mark comments we make to ourselves. In every script, you'll see this at the top. These are libraries, which are collections of formulas and functions that we can use so we don't have to write code from scratch. Pandas is used if you're working on tables. Matplotlib is used used for, you guessed it, plots. Starting symbol, these here are variables or placeholders. At the moment, x equals 2, y equals 3.5. And with that, we can do mathematical operations, such as multiply them together to create a new variable z. We can also display information by using print. So if I run this on the console, it will print the value of z. Here, I'm importing Excel data from my computer into Python. PD is a short form of pandas. So I'm using pandas function read Excel to load the Excel file. The data, which is in the table, will be called df from now on. This is how we single out columns in a data frame. Here, I'm telling Python to create a new column called discount, and it will be the amount column multiplied by 10%. Whenever you see this, this means a function. A function is a block of code where you define it once and then it can be used numerous times in your script. Indentation defines blocks of code, which means it can be taken as one element. This function is called calculate total sales and multiplies quantity by amount, revealing the total sales for each item. We create a column called total sales and we tell Python to use the function and apply it to every row in the data frame. When you see a function defined, you'll see a corresponding action to apply the function creating plots. Here we tell Python we're plotting from our data frame, our x-axis, our y-axis, and the type of plot, a line plot. You can also name the title x and y-axis here. This shows a plot, so when you run it, it creates this lovely plot. Lastly, you can export the final data frame where we added the discount column and the sales column as an Excel file to be stored to your local computer. That's all there ever is to Python. Don't search for anything more. Okay, bye.